Hey guys, Lone Wolf 2864 playing some Gunmaster on scrap metal. This is about the third match that I played, and the first two matches I led the whole entire round, and then of course ended up losing right at the very end. I swear to God, man, the, L the LVG launcher is just oh god, that is the worst idea for a freaking Gunmaster gun. They I mean, they could even swap it out for like a freaking smoke grenade launcher and let me hit somebody in the face with it, and that'd kill people faster than this thing does. But anyway, I got off to a rough start on this one. I just found myself in a couple of bad positions. I mean, you'll you'll notice when you play Gunmaster as a <laughs> run through two guys there. But you'll notice when you play Gunmaster, you'll end up getting out of position, and what always ends up happening is you end up running into more than one guy, and you're like, oh God, help! Just like this right here. There's one guy, but then there's another one directly behind him. So, Anyway, once I get past the initial start here, I pretty much burn through the rest of the guns and gets kind of close to the end. But Anyway, a couple of things I wanted to talk about today. Uh, we've got Endgame coming out, I believe, next week for PlayStation 3. So I will be putting up a few videos. And nice backflip, bro. Definitely worth a 10. But anyway, i definitely be trying to put up some videos of that on the PS3. I don't play on PS3 a whole lot, but since I have Battlefield 3 Premium and we get it a week early and sit down. Since we get it a week earlier on PlayStation 3, I'll go ahead and put some videos up of that. So you can definitely be looking out for that next week. And then I believe the following week you'll get it on PC, so... I'll be very excited to get it on PC, but uh, also going to be joining up with some guys uh, in a gaming community, gaming clan, uh, over at Accelerated Gamers, or Accelerated Gaming. Um, my cousin, uh, he may start posting some videos on this channel as well. Uh, he plays on Xbox mainly. But uh, he got me hooked up with these guys. They're looking to get into the PC gaming community and uh, definitely willing to help them out any way I can. So I'll leave a link to their uh, forum in the description if you guys want to check them out. Uh, if you're interested in joining up with them, they play on uh, Xbox, PS3, and soon to be PC. Uh, they play on a variety of games. They've got Call of Duty, uh, both, I believe, Modern Warfare 3 and Black Ops 2 as well as Battlefield 3 for both consoles and uh, Halo 4 and there may even be a few others so definitely give those guys a look if you're interested in joining with some uh, just uh, overall good group of guys so definitely check them out so anyway back to the gameplay here Mark, make my way through to the P90 and uh, unload on this guy here at the top of the stairs and I don't know if it was this round or if it was the round before. There was one round where I got to the shotguns and I must have killed at least five or six guys. Oh, this may be it. Yeah, there's one, two. There's the third guy. And then I get killed from behind. But no, it wasn't this round. It must have been the round before. I got, I mean, literally burned through three different guns in a matter of like five or six seconds. It was just crazy. But um, if you guys will... Just give me some feedback on uh, what kind of games that you want me to play more on this channel. I'd like to dedicate myself to more than, or excuse me, I'd like to dedicate myself to more time on one game in particular instead of hopping all around and all that kind of jazz. But I, I do enjoy playing a variety of games and mixing it up because then it gets tiring playing one game for a matter, you know, for a while you get tired of playing one game. But I'm definitely more into Battlefield 3 than any of the other games that I've posted on this channel. Uh, I know Crisis 3 just came out, so I'm going to try to purchase that my next paycheck and start putting up gameplays of that. I really enjoyed the beta, and if the beta was uh, any indication how the gameplay is in the final version, then I'm definitely looking forward to it. I've seen plenty of videos of some of the other YouTubers putting up gameplay videos from it, and it definitely, definitely seems to be a lot of fun. So. I've also got uh, LCPDFR GTA 4 mod that you saw uh, last week when I put that up. I enjoy playing that just to just to have some uh, fun goof off around, play around with 
a game that you don't have to really take serious. So that's more of a stress reliever, I guess, than anything. But yeah, just give me some feedback. Uh, if there's any games that we haven't posted on our channel yet that you guys are interested in, just let me let me know. Like I said, my cousin uh, Jeremy, too legit for this. He'll be uh, uploading some gameplays sooner rather than later, I imagine. And he's big into Battlefield on the Xbox. Uh, I know he also plays Call of Duty. Uh, I myself am not into the Call of Duty world, so if you uh, would like to see some Call of Duty gameplay, I can get him to start uploading some of that. But back to the gameplay here. So I've made my way up to the Scar L. And as far as Gunmaster's strategy goes, I don't, I don't think there's a lot of strategy. And there's another nice backflip. Uh, I don't think there's a lot of strategy is involved as far as like, because I mean it's pretty much just free. Well, it should be free for all to begin with. I mean everybody knows that the stupidest thing in the world is having teams on Gunmaster. But there's a nice double kill with the LMG, which never happens. I mean my God, I was, I was well over. 20 feet away from those guys and I actually killed them with an LMG. What? But anyway, uh, as far as strategy goes, uh, just don't do that. Don't freaking mag dump an LMG. I got away with one, but anyway, th my strategy is just to run around wide open the entire time. I mean, just, and then look at this! What kind of garbage is that? Com I mean, he was completely out of position, completely outplayed, and he gets away with a panic knife. Ah, that just burns me up. I can't stand that crap. But anyway, so yeah, my strategy would be just to run around and uh, keep trying to get as many kills as possible. As you see here, I keep dying over and over, but while I was playing, I was just thinking to myself, you know, if I can keep getting kills each time I die, I'm advancing one step at a time. And I was in a tight race, you can see at the bottom, with the guy in second. And I don't remember if we ended up getting caught back up or not, and that guy just ran face first into my bullets. Wasn't even aiming at you, sir, but I'll take it anyway. But I can't remember if we ended up getting tied here towards the end of the round or not. I don't think we do, but... And then, hello, my lord, and I get the double with the M417, but I can't get the hip fire with the bolt action. If I would have been able to clean up all those guys, I, I would have just completely quit for the night. <laughs> I would have just been done. Oh, that's that's good enough for me. So I also heard today some uh, more interesting news, this time relating to Battlefield 4. Uh, apparently, uh, I don't know if this just coincided with the press release Sony had with the PS4 last week, or if this was already planned. But uh, apparently EA met with uh, some of the guys from Sony and some of the guys from Microsoft uh, to show off some of the new features and a little bit of gameplay, I guess, from Battlefield 4. And from what came out of that meeting, as far as what they showed off, apparently looked amazing. So I cannot wait to see footage of that. Uh, I think we'll probably end up seeing some of that. Obviously, it'll be after Endgame's release. They, they don't want to release footage of a new game before they release the last DLC for the current game. But I think we'll probably end up seeing something at E3, possibly. Because I'm pretty sure E3 is not until, like, June, if I'm not mistaken. So this seems like a good time to show off some of this new stuff. But uh, that, that was one of the reasons I was excited about the next-gen consoles coming out, is... The developers will be, well, they won't be near as limited as they are now. And that should bode well for PC gameplay as well as the console gameplay. And, uh, they should be able to do a whole lot more than what they, they currently have. So. And at this point in Gunmaster, when I get down to this bolt action, this is usually where I run into a brick wall, but fortunate enough this round and oh my gosh I forgot about this look how goofy this is these guys legs sticking through the wall I miss it once and then right in the back of the foot if you're gonna lay there I'll gladly take advantage of that and now down to my most favorite weapon the LVG saw a couple of guys drop down into that little manhole there so I tried to sneak one down there couldn't get nothing Got a hit marker there, so the no scope 
gets it. And now we have to run around and try to find some unsuspecting victim. I see this guy coming down the hallway here, and it's just like, okay, come on, man, come on, keep following me around here, and I'm just gonna give you one good swipe, and that'll do it. Didn't get the animation, but doesn't matter. Luckily, I got him when I did, because you see I died right after that. But Anyway, go ahead, guys, and give me a like and a favorite, if you will. That'll help me out a ton. And uh, go ahead and leave me a comment below, like I said earlier, and let me know what kind of games you want to see uploaded on this channel and what game in particular you'd like for me to do. Uh, as well as check the description for the link to Accelerated Gaming. Uh, give those guys a, a look and see if you're interested in joining up with them. I'm sure they'd be glad to have you. But until next time, guys, uh, hope you enjoyed the video and have a nice day.